Trotters picking up speed, and here they come. And they're off and trotting, trying to blast out is Tuscan Prince and Chapper Craze from the far outside. A little expensive, and Andy Miller, they have the hammer down. Up your Dale, sprinting out of there. Towards the inside is Hasty Bid. Off stride went Tuscan Prince. Tuscan Prince has made a break. Celebrity Bambino gets away in fourth. To the outside then is Winner's Bet. Down to the rail, Osceola, followed by... Challenger, and then outside, that'll be Chapper Craze going back to gain tan over Tuscan Prince's last. 26 and 3 was the opening quarter. Little expensive. The big long shot sprinted out to the lead. Up your Deo in second for the time being. Hasty Bid trots along in third. Celebrity Bambino follows that one closely fourth. To the outside is Winner's Bet looking to get a trip. Scooting up the rail will be Osceola seeing some space, followed by Challenger. Stacked up is Chapper Craze. Gain Tanover wants to follow, and Tuscan Prince catches back up after the early break. So a little expensive. Brings them up to the half in 56 and 1. Got an easy second quarter there. Here's the pocket pop now coming from up your Dale. Svonstead waited as long as he could. Comes to the outside. The sprint's on here in the third quarter. Little expensive. Up your Dale to the wheel. Looking to advance his hasty bid, who follows the leader. Second over now is Celebrity Bambino. Winner's bet is third over. Then it's Osceola stacked up. That's going to be Chapper Craze, followed by Gaines Hanover. Challenger at the rail, followed by Tuscan Prince. Here's three quarters 124 flat and little expensive has brought them this far up your Dale on the outside now looks to overtake hasty bit will look to split on through celebrity bambino is off cover and charging but up your Dale takes the lead celebrity bambino winners bet chapper craze on the far outside hasty bit coming up the inside it's up your Dale. celebrity bambino pushing his winners bet hasty bit at the rail a great finish coming up celebrity bambino winners bet celebrity bambino winners bet was second hasty bit third up up your Dale fourth, 151 and four, Celebrity Bambino in the Trotting Classic. Ron Burke and Yannick Gingra combine here for this year's win of the Canadian Trotting Classic with Celebrity Bambino, and what a finish from all Split on through. Celebrity Bambino is off cover and charging, but Up Your Dale takes the lead. Celebrity Bambino, winner's bet. Chapper Craze on the far outside. Hasty bid coming up the inside. It's Up Your Dale. Celebrity Bambino pushing his winner's bet. Hasty bid at the rail. A great finish coming up. Celebrity Bambino, winner's bet. Celebrity Bambino. Winner's bet was second. Hasty bid third. Up your Dale fourth, 151 and four. Celebrity Bambino in the Trotting Classic. See you there, there you go. All right guys, looking right here, big smile over here. Perfect, and we'll get you a front All right, guys, looking right over here, please. Right here, looking my way. Wonderful. Great. And we're just going to. Celebrity Bambino captures the Canadian Trotting Classic. I'm here with the winning driver Yannick Jingra and assistant trainer Mickey Burke. Yannick, I just want to start with you first. This Colt's been just so snake bitten in just about every single final. I mean, what went right tonight? Well, actually, honestly, at the start of the race, it wasn't going right again. Uh, he felt so good warming up in the post parade. He was right on the bid the way I wanted him, and uh, the gate opened up, and he, he was his footing wasn't right. right. He wasn't trotting good, and um, it looks like I was going to get away in a pretty bad spot there. Uh, it was a bunch of levers, and then uh, but the race the race kind of changed when Louis made a break, and at the same time, the outside horses grabbed up, you know. So um, and you no, know, I got him through the first turn, and after that, the, you know, I was then I was happy. Went, went right. Uh, I knew Aki would pull the two holes, so I just wanted to get to him to get the nice cover for my Colt, and uh, he did the rest. 
you know, you came first over in the Breeders' Crown last year here, and you got picked off by Gaines Hanover. You were coming first over. Were you pleased when Aki pulled from the two-hole to kind of give your colt a little bit of a rest? Oh, absolutely. You know, I don't think he would have won if I was first up, honestly, uh, because I would have, you know, carried Dexter right into the race. But, uh, you know, you get to this, time, this point of the year, you know, the... The other horses, and I know, um, I know Aki's horse, right? That's the way he was going to race him. He, he, he wants to chase horses, so I, I knew he would pull. Like I said, so it was just a matter of getting to him. With how well he raced in the elimination last week, were you confident of giving this guy a target tonight? Uh, yes and no. You know, he's got the ability. You know, like I said last week in the interview, it's, it's to get it out of him. Uh, you know, he's got uh, tremendous ability, tre tremendous speed. Um, you know, we got to get him a, a few more trips like like these, and uh, then I, I think. Uh, you know, you'll do the job. Congratulations, Yannick. Thank you very much. All right, here with assistant trainer Mickey Burke. Uh, uh, Mickey, I mean, how frustrating was it for you to see this guy just not being able to deliver in the big race and get it done tonight? It's, it's, it was a great thing tonight, but, you know, it, it's, it's part of racing. There's times when things just don't go your way, and unfortunately everything went the way we wanted it to go today, and it all worked out. Talk about his development from age two to age three. Talk about what you felt like uh, what the difference was going into a sophomore campaign. I think he just got bigger and stronger, and he's just his attitude's great, and he just wants to go forward. So now it's just getting him in the right position and everything going his way. You got TCI in the Mohawk Million. I mean, what are your thoughts on him? I actually am happy with both of the Colts I got in that race, uh, TCI especially. I mean, he's been great this year. He's been great here especially, and so it, we're. Real, I'm you know I'm excited to go into this race with with these two Colts going. Congratulations, Mickey. Thank you much. Mickey Burke, Yannick Dringra, Celebrity Bambino, get it done in the Canadian Trotting Classic.